Education Monday, Education Monday on the Tribal Root Studio with Alina Zahil. I would like to see all of you guys in your professions where you are coming back to the drawing board and now asking the question, how can we start a business? Changing mindsets in Africa, making a world better. Together, we can make a difference. We are fixing Africa. Education Monday. Education Monday. This is the Tribal Root Studio once again, and today is Monday. Here we bring the Education Monday uh, session once again. The program that brings you knowledge, the program that empowers, the program that uh, reminds you that really, really, uh, this is Africa, and we need to have the right mindset for us to progress. My name is Alina Zahir and I am seated inside the Tribal Root Studio. We are located in Ishaka Busheni, Uganda and this our location is on the foothills of the mountains of the moon. You need to read stories about the mountains of the moon, uh, the people, uh, the environment and the history. It's all uh, uh, very, very inspiring and empowering really. Uh, so today on the Monday program we want to talk about business and we want to talk about the importance of uh, 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 Africa and business, the importance of us thinking business, uh, taking the direction of uh, having the mindset of being able to do business, to transact and to empower ourselves in that way. Uh, so many of our people uh, in Africa especially are taking the route of uh, get educated, get a job, get those papers, get employed by someone. And this is, I think, the best that everyone is doing. Uh, everyone is trying to acquire education, more education and more education. Uh, but no one is talking about who is employing us, who is giving us the jobs, who determines our salaries. Is it worthy? Uh, is it worthy for us to invest all this money in education and then have no say on who employs us? Uh, what we do and what we are paid. So this is the topic I am going to introduce today and I would like it to open your mind to more open thinking to make sure that uh, going forward we are taking the right steps really. Once again, I would like to implore you to subscribe to this channel and make sure to share uh, to others who may not have heard about us and because we believe that we really have to speak to the rest of the world until the whole world hears. Uh, Tribal Root Studio is here to inspire you and to empower you. If you have any uh, suggestions you would like us to talk about, you can leave them in the comment section. I will gladly uh, be uh, bringing them up in the next episodes. So today we are talking about business. And for most of the African people, I believe that we are not uh, pursuing uh, being business people or being people that can produce for others to consume. For a very long time, we have been treated as uh, the marketplace. We've been treated as the market base. We've been treated as the consumer. And I think most of the world looks at Africa as that asset where you will produce everything that you want and you throw them to Africa and we will gladly buy. We really buy. Uh, the clothes, the shoes, the, the hair, the food, everything. And then talk about automobiles, everything. We really buy. And this is something that everyone needs to think about. If we are a population that buys more than we manufacture, that buys more than we produce, then there is a problem there. And you know, Africa's challenge, Africa's problems have been discussed for decades. People have talked about Africa's problem being uh, the last uh, at the bottom all the time. When they refer to Africa, everyone thinks about that poor continent. Everyone thinks about the naked children. Everyone thinks about disease. Everyone thinks about wars. Everyone thinks about plunder. But why is this? because we are still holding on to the wrong mindset that sets Africa on the wrong path and this is the time for us to wake up to make sure we are taking the right steps to our independence, we are taking the right steps to redemption and we cannot take these right steps without knowing 
And this is the reason why this program is here, to make sure we make you know, we empower you with knowledge, and we push you to make sure you are taking these steps to make sure we can fix Africa. All the time we talk about fixing Africa, we are serious about that, and we want you to take a part. We want you to participate. We want you to contribute. We want you to be a part of this movement. And this is the Tribal Root Studio once again. So this is the point right now. If we have most of our intelligent men and women taking the path of uh, education and employment, then there is a big gap to bridge between who is employing and who is being employed and then how can we now work together between these two parties to make sure we can create a system, we can create a system that is sustaining us, that is going to be uh, very enriching for all of our people. So I think most of the professionals or most of the people who are into professions are losing sight of the right things, of the right steps to take. Because I believe that with the education you have acquired, with all the degrees to your name, with all the papers that you carry, you should be the right person right now to lead the people into the direction of making money, making profits, doing business, producing, and making sure that your mind is not tied to a job, your mind is not tied to a job where you have to sit somewhere, contribute all your knowledge and skills only to sit and wait for meager salaries. And this is what is happening in Africa on the most part. So I would like to see uh, engineers, I would like to see uh, business, uh, I mean bankers, I would like to see economists, I would like to see uh, doctors, I would like to see all of you guys in your professions where you are coming back to the drawing board and now asking the question how can we start a business? How can we together start a business that will sustain our lives? where we will dictate what we are paid, where we will dictate the terms of work, where we will dictate the direction that we are taking. How can we start these businesses? Because if you are able to work in a bank, then you should also be able to create a system, a money system that works for all the people. If you are able to work in a hospital, you should be in position now to create the hospital, to create the hospital environment that works for everyone. If you are able to do agriculture, you should be able now to create a system that connects the producer, the farmer, the consumer, and the manufacturer or the processor of value addition. So, we want to see very many uh, Africans now uh, taking this direction of thinking like business people and also realizing that as much as we can consume uh, goods produced by other economies, we should realize that the time has come when we need to produce and to make sure everything in our communities, everything in our environment that we are using is produced by us. Let's invest in production, let's invest in manufacturing, let's invest in acquiring knowledge to make sure we can produce most of the things that we need. Let's invest in this. And let's see so many people who would like to work with us, to work with others to make sure these things can really happen. From the Tribal Root Studio, we give you this message. And our message is not empty because we have different programs that are already ongoing where we would like you to contribute, where we would like you to participate, where we would like you to take a part. And you can contact us anytime. If you check the description and the comment section, you'll find our contacts. If you have anything that you'd like to do or you need help or you need to connect with the rest of the people that think like you, please, you can go ahead and write the email. You can go ahead and call. You can go ahead and even uh, contact us on WhatsApp. We will be able and ready to speak to you and also ready to work with you. Thank you for tuning into Education Monday. My name is Alina Zahil once again, and this is the Tribal Roots Studio. Remember to subscribe. Have yourselves a great day.